be the funniest spot in Westport on a Friday night. Trying to get from the kitchen to the bedroom. Only there are a few things funny about a virus and a mask mandate. For me, it's not a political issue, it's a health issue. So everyone in this room only gets in if they're fully vaccinated. If we don't require everyone to be vaccinated, then everyone in the room has to wear masks, including the talent on the stage. Tim says that's no way to put on a show full of improv. So folks coming to the show have to bring their vaccination card. We gave back a whole bunch of refunds. The KC Improv Company has been reopened since late June. Friday night was the first time they had to turn people away. They say that's a tough thing to do when you count on the crowd to keep the business going, but add it's also the quality of the show that keeps the doors open. And if you're performing, but you're wearing a mask, you can't hear me very well. We don't want to put on a show like that. Tim says pre-pandemic, capacity was about 100 people. Now it's just over 60. That's why every ticket sold is critical. But more importantly, he says it's about the safety of the patrons and performers. Good old days, we'd pack the crowd in here and those things are not good for spread of a virus. Wasn't a second thought for me. Well, I was actually excited. I had to show my vaccination. So for now, as long as you've been vaccinated, the improv goes on. In Westport, Alan Schultz, Canby C9 